strip her titles now. Public madly throw eggs that Meghan is using title to influence US. Meghan Markle is making her mark on the political landscape once again, and it's caused quite a stir. The Duchess of Sussex urged her fellow Americans to vote in the midterm elections, which will decide who sits in the House of Representatives and the Senate and can make nationwide laws. Along with millions of voters across the US, Meghan headed down to a polling station to exercise her own civic duty and shared a photo on her actual site with an I Voted sticker on her t-shirt. The reaction to Meghan's dive into US politics has divided many, which is pretty reflective of the country as a whole as the fight for control of the Senate is on a knife edge right now. The Democrats, who currently hold both chambers of Congress, are expected to lose the House but the anticipated red wave of Republican votes has not happened. On the Archul site, Meghan and Prince Harry wrote a message urging people to cast their vote and have a say in the elections, which are called the midterms because that happen in the middle of a president's four-year term. They also shared a text service number which aims to help find polling locations and other information for voters as well as a checklist of things to do. Today is election day in the US. Time to get out and vote. Read the post. Text Archul to 26797 to find your polling location and make sure you are ready to vote. There was a mix of strong reactions online, with some angry Americans calling for the Duchess of Sussex to have her titles stripped. One person tweeted, strip their titles now. This is wildly inappropriate. Meghan Markle can vote, but this campaigning to get people to vote is not appropriate for a royal. Strip that Duchess of Sussex title now, Charles. She's ignorant and arrogant about her royal status, and it reflects on you. I don't disagree with what she says about voting here. But as long as she has a British royal title, she shouldn't be using the status it gives her to influence any part of our voting process. Plenty of people are encouraging others to vote. Meghan's voice won't be missed, added another. A calmer voice said, it isn't the Duchess that needs to go but the HRH. In my opinion, this should be removed from both of them, not put in abeyance and then that would, I believe, remove their royalness and they can do as they please without any negative reflection on the royal family. Meghan Markle is hitting the polls. In a new photo shared on her actual site on election day on Tuesday, the Duchess of Sussex flashes a smile as she sports an I Voted sticker. The picture accompanied a news release titled Vote with a short message encouraging Americans to cast their ballots. Today is election day in the US. Time to get out and vote. The statement said. Text Archul to 26797 to find your polling location and make sure you are ready to vote. The statement went on to share a handful of tips for those voting in person, like confirming polling location bringing the right ID and reviewing what's on the ballot, with links to more info at nonpartisan sites I am a voter, vote riders and ballot ready. People previously confirmed that Meghan, 41, was the first person in the modern royal family to vote in a US presidential election during the 2020 race. At the time, a source told people that the Duchess was voting in this election, but declined to disclose whether she voted early or locally in California, where she and Prince Harry live with their son Archie, 3, and daughter Lilibet, 1. While appearing in an ABC special to mark the annual Time 100 issue that year, Meghan said, Every four years, we're told, this is the most important election of our lifetime. But this one is. When we vote, our values are put into action, and our voices are heard. As a member of the British royal family, Prince Harry has never voted in any election in the UK, but he made a non-partisan intervention, hoping that the election would not descend into hurtful language, especially online.